Are we in rock and roll heaven? Good evening, my good The run starts at Harley Davidson of Lancaster. We're getting ready to go on the poker run, 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 run up to uh, Leona Valley. And then we'll go up to Lake Elizabeth, the Rock Inn. And then we'll go up over 138 and come over to Coaches. And then we'll come all the way back up to the fairgrounds. We'll get our t-shirts and, and then start having some fun with all the car shows and bike shows and everything they're gonna have. This is the uh, bike show uh, area. We're doing the bike show in here today. So what we've got is we've got 15 different classes, and out of the uh, uh, 15 classes, we got 66 trophies uh, for all the, uh, the classes that are here. Today we're doing, as you can see behind me, we're doing factory demo rides. It's a good opportunity to try different bikes. Some of these people will be out here all day long demoing different bikes that we have. Right now, there's 14 different models you can try. You got bikes from the uh, late 50s and 60s era. A lot of these, like right now, are coming up. These are the vet class. The older guys that raced back in the 50s and 60s and 70s. I like it a lot. It's definitely a good cause to come out here and race. Ron has been gracious enough to host the Alternative Energy or Green Energy Expo that we're putting on this year. This will be the second year of the Energy Expo and the third year of the Alternative Fuels Vehicle Cruise In. Today we're helping people understand a little bit more about some ways that they can improve the environment, improve their life, and protect future generations. Thunder of the Lock, 80 to uh, mix with the other charities that are beneficiaries of uh, Thunder on the Lot. We thank all the sponsors for Thunder on the Lot. Uh, it's uh, through their support that we're, we're able to benefit from the monies that are raised here at Thunder. We're on our 15th year with Thunder on the Lot and um, not only does the event get bigger, but it uh, looks like our uh, Fundraising efforts get larger and our, our mission gets stronger and uh, a lot more people show up. We always can use all the help that we can get from people. We need, we need people to come in. We need, always need volunteers, although there's many of them. You know, it just keeps turning over. But the main thing we need is people to help us put it on, our sponsors, etc. because we've always been able to donate the money that we make here because the sponsors pay for the event and put it together. You know, everyone knows why we're here. We're here for the kids. Um, they have a chance to get to know all the charities and walk right up to their booths and see what all these fundraising dollars are going to. It almost makes me emotional because 
we're able to depend on so many people year after year who sacrifice a lot of time and money and energy and uh, a lot of support, a lot of sponsorship. And uh, I don't know, this, this event is so blessed. We're just so blessed. I'm really proud of the sponsors, the participants, all the people that have helped. It's a great day.